do, do, do. Okay, that was a good first match. And that is a very cute Dragonite you posted in chat, Gaz. See, Dragonite's so cool, but I'd, I'd love to be able to use it, but it's just way too, way too complicated. It, I, I still think it's fun. I still think you should do it. Still get the, the Dragonair. Look, you played the Believe Venusaur deck. I think you can play Dragonite much better. Oh no. Counter. Wait, what? Water? Dark Water deck? Well, if, is that a. That's coughing, so you'd literally just the Dragonite deck you were talking about with the wheezing stall. Oh, of course. Okay, um, research and then Pokeball. Uh, yeah. Actually, I, no, I don't think so. Because you get so. four basics, I think your odds are actually currently in favour of getting a Mewtwo. And then you get a ch better chance of drawing into, like, Curlia and Gardevoir. Yeah, so it's actually Pokeball and then Research. Yeah. And the art for this is so cool. Oh, God. <laughs> Look at it, it's beautiful. Mm. I'm kind of disappointed how badly my phone lags trying to do like the full immersive experience with it when I pulled it. It was all just like stop start and the music was a mess. Damn, unfortunate. So I was just thinking then, how do you think Yuri Geller feels that I named this deck after him? I don't know. I think he felt repentant when he actually allowed the use of it again. So, in sort of encouraging, oh yeah, I hope people have fun using you know, Kadabra in their decks in future. So, maybe. <laughs> but then, so does that mean no one ran Alakazam then? Like, how, um, how did it work? So... Throughout the years, they sort of had a couple of different ways of doing it. Uh, one of them was Abra would have an ability that basically allowed it to skip a stage. Okay. Or either an ability or attack, so that its means of evolution would be to jump straight to Alakazam. Or they would use uh, mechanics like the Big EX or Radiant Pokemon, where you can have a stage 2 Pokemon that is a basic. So you can just play the Alak so Radiant Alakazam is a basic Pokemon despite being an Alakazam. Right. But it has a rule box and you know, special conditions so you can only use the one Radiant Alakazam in your deck. This isn't good. It's, uh... Okay. It's okay now. <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm actually switching in the Mewtwo here, because if he gets Starmie, that's really going to set us back. No, you're building it up on the bench. Do I use a potion? No. Because he gets Starmie. Either it's not going to KO you anyway, or it's going to KO you. And I think you would rather save the potion for an attack on Mewtwo. Yeah. Though two nineties, it it doesn't solve the numbers on Mewtwo by using potion. But it depends what Mewtwo's uh, not. Uh, it depends what the Starmie is partnered with. Okay. Or if you get the second potion. Hmm. Wow. Well, all I can do here is energy and attack. Uh, yes. Cause... Sorry, I'm just having an internal debate over Giovanni, but I yeah, don't know if I do different. sixty, it's not really. It doesn't make a difference. No. no.
Oh, this does not work out at all because it's just going to kill you before you can attack it properly. Yeah. Um, I mean, what can I do? That, that's 10? That's not even like, it's not even 20, you know? I mean, if you get a second potion, it buys you a turn. That might be enough. You kind of want other things more than a second potion. Um, I could potentially just X speed into this one. Yeah. Like, do I use both X speeds here? I was wondering that. Um. There isn't a right option. The thing because is... it's sort of, well, you're just going to take, you're not going to do any damage. You're going to then take damage, and then you're not going to be able to retreat back into the one that's already got the energy on it if you're. So I think maybe one X speed, but not both. What? Yeah. What if I. I could Sabrina. He brings in the Articuno. I then bring in this Mewtwo. And then that would make him debate whether to stay in and attack. Or just sacrifice the energy and bring in the Starmie again. Yeah. But yeah, only one X speed use because then that gives you another one to sort of pivot back. Yeah. If uh, the know. opportunity presents itself later in the game. But it's not good. It's not. Oh my god, I'm gonna run out of time. Come on. That's bullshit. Yeah, I mean it was taking too long, so. But if the, if the game's GG. playing through animations, how am I supposed yeah, the to? Yeah, image probably shouldn't run through an animation. Whatever. <sighs> like surely, if you make a move, it should give you a couple more seconds, you know. Oh well. Hmm. Starmie's a good card. It is. It is very good. I card. really enjoyed this. I enjoyed the Starmie pitch up deck and kind of. I don't know. I want to say surprised that no. Not other people are. Other people are not using it. Not rather. together at least, no. Like, Pidgeot has its own um, Discord, like its own chat. Where is it? So Pidgeot Control is, has been placed in Tier 2 on the Decade's um, server. I don't know that server. Decade's... Okay, Pidgeot Control with Arbok. So, yeah, um, that's that deck we played the other day. Yeah, so it's just Pidgeot Lion and Arbok. So, yeah, it's definitely you. It's definitely up there. Anyway, yeah, Decade's just that big. Well, I know him through, through Yu Gi Oh! and he set up his own Pokemon channel now. Alright. I, I played in a few Jewel League tournaments on his Discord. Oh, uh, yeah. When you were a whale for a different game. Yeah, exactly. Um, so, problem here. I'm going to have to use this energy to switch into Mewtwo. No, you're not. Well, I'm staying in. Yeah. I think that Ralph is going to eat shit and die. And you just invest in Mewtwo. Okay. Sorry, so little uh, Ralts. We we Weezing will knock out. Assuming it is actually weak to dark, which I assume it is. Yeah. Like, it's not worth taking that same damage on the Mewtwo. Bam. Dead. 
Okay. Because at least, you know, you can bring this in now, start doing damage. When it attacks you, you can then start using potions and things. I'm debating. Do I go for a Giovanni here? I mean, uh, he's only got one card in hand. Yeah. What are the chances that it's going to be a potion? Yeah, no, I, I like that because that, yeah, 60 plus 50 is pretty good. Uh, You should be taking more damage from that. He's weak to Psychic. What kind of game is this? Not the one you know. So, the problem is that... Wow, yeah, Venishock is bad. Um... I'm using the potions, right? Yes, you are. Because Muck can't Venom shock you next turn, which gives you enough time to then be able to sort of one-shot it if it comes in. Yeah. Give him something to think about. So... He's still going to take poison damage for a couple of turns. Does he bring in the Ekans, which I can then one shot? Nice. <laughs> Don't evolve. Okay, that's. Oh, that's. Uh... Okay, hold on. What? What are the numbers is on the Venoshock? Venoshock is if you're 70 attack, plus seventy plus 50. fifty. Yeah, so that's gonna just kill you either way. Um, so oh, it's three, isn't it? It's difficult. Do you? Why did you attach the Mewtwo? I got overexcited. Okay. <laughs> uh, that okay well, just said it all. That, <laughs> because of that, I'm inclined to say Sabrina, and then actually just blow your load on whatever comes in. I assume it's going to be the Grimer. What was your idea anyway? I mean, switching the Rolts? Attaching to Rolts. For future, using the Giovanni to care of the Ekans and praying. Oh wait, they've already taken a point. You've lost. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> that, that's the thing. I, I've lost. You lose. Yeah, you Good day, sir. <laughs> oh, you gotta you gotta keep track of these things. Um, well, I mean, that I, I knew that. I mean, it's like, yeah, yeah, this is game. Yeah, it is. Hmm. Was there any play with the retreat yet? I don't think so. Not really, I don't think. Because you just would have switched in the muck anyway. Because, like, yeah, you can hit for, I think it's like 20 with rolls. Maybe 10, I don't know. Uh Oh, uh, that would have maybe bought an extra turn or two, but the lack of Gardevoir getting close. I mean, that deck was clearly built to counter new two decks, so, you know, mm. it, it did its thing. It did what it was supposed to do. Yeah. 
Okay, this is a good hand. Get the rolls with the Pokeball. It's fine. Mm. It's a mirror match, I think. Oh, if I press start, do. Yeah. Oh, that's uh. Hmm. So you get an attach first, but they could get Gardevoir up first. Alright, alright, show off. You literally have the same thing. <laughs> okay, uh... Give me the rules. There we go. Although, I'm worried about... Whoa, he's not going to Sabrina me just yet. I've got a bench yeah, here, right? Yes. Bench, attach the Mewtwo. And then that's it. You've got an X speed in hand. And, you know, without. You can't play Sabrina and Giovanni at the same time to KO the Rolls. Like, I don't think you're worried about that. You would rather have it in play to then get Curlia. Yeah. Okay. That's the other Mewtwo. Or not? Nope. Um, yeah, you can bench that as well. So... I, f I feel like sabrina -ing. Sabrina. Yeah, right? I feel yeah. like sabrina -ing. Yeah, because you either bring in an undamaged... Well, uh, an undamaged one with no energy and can start hurting that. Oh. Or this. That's gonna. That's for the retreat cost. Yeah, it is. That that sort of hints an X speed in hand. Yeah, hundred percent. Or just gonna let it die. Okay. That's fine. What? Retreat, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, so no X speed in hand. That is interesting. I mean, that that's still. Ah, okay. That's not good. Really not good uh, because we still haven't got the bloody curl here. Well, I feel like just leaving that Rolt in, attaching to Mewtwo. For then swinging against the other one. Yeah, no, that's that that strategy is fine. Because really, that uh, God of Ours ability only works on active Pokemon, so it's like is it only active. Yeah. Okay. Um. But it can do that. It can then start manually attaching to the bench. Yeah. That would be in sort of anticipation. Play, right? Yeah. Because it's not intending to swing for 200 this turn. Oh. Uh, what? I. What? Why? It, it's calling your bluff, basically. I think is. Uh, it's going well if you're going to, you know, try and basically it's going to try and bait you into carrying this one, okay, so that it can then get a retaliation. <laughs> I like how you're saying it. <laughs> well, it is in the play. Okay, I definitely should be running two curliers. What the hell? Why am I not running two curliers? Oh yeah. Wait, are you? I am, right? Wait, you only run... I thought you were running a 2-2-1. There was only one Gardevoir you were... I hope so. <laughs> I also hope so, to be honest. Because that would have made things much different. 
Um, so. Hmm. Uh, I honestly don't hate just attacking with damage rolls. <laughs> Just like, no, no, I'm just going to sit here until... Uh... It's going to ram into you. Take some of that. You don't want to... I, I think you want the extra turn. And I don't know what you want to do with it. Because it's like, well, a Sabrina would be nice, but it's not going to fall for that, is it? It's... Ah, what do I do? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Is there a way out? I really don't think there is. There really isn't. Like, you've had basically two or three turns now where if you draw the curlier, this could have potentially done something. Yeah, alright. Well, that doesn't matter because. It doesn't. Um. Just fall into the trap. You know, take the care, get what's in care. There's no. There's no way out. <laughs> it's game. Uh. Let me check and see if I'm running too early or. You better be, or does he. I'm, I'm, I'm just gonna cry. I think, because this has been a common problem in a couple of games now. What are you doing, my guy? Just, just met play. Make your play. Yeah. Whoop. I like this. I like the sound of that. Whoop. Defeat. So, are you going to be buying the? Spark in Zero Dragon Ball game? No. <laughs> I'm... I, I kind of want to, but at the same time, I'm not 100% sure. You're only one, running one curly, are you dunce? <laughs> uh, okay, so I am dropping a red card, right? Yes. Yes. That's <sighs> <sighs> Joe. <laughs> can't, can't trust you to do anything. <laughs> oh dear. That's why this has been so hard. I like it hard. I like it hard. <laughs> So much dirty shit I could say right now. I'm thinking maybe two more matches with the Mewtwo deck and then maybe make something different. Or we could try my Fero Pidgeot deck. No, no, we, we, we we're gonna go back to that Wonder Pit, we're gonna find that, that Dragonair. And build the Dragonite. Yeah, gonna make but, the dream real. Oh yeah, no, he definitely needs dragon out. Uh, Zapdos. You know, I really don't rate Zapdos. Zap Zapdos EX. Oh yeah, no, I I think it's terrible because the big attack is a coin flip based one, and it seems to be there for the pure fact that it's got the HP and is a basic electric that's just you know bulky. But then it's just taken up Other more than spots good. that could be, like, you could draw into Pikachu. I mean, the point is you still need all the, the, the things to, bench, to fill the bench for Pikachu. 
So you need something in there, and it's just sort of... The choices aren't amazing, but I don't... I personally don't think Zapdos is the answer. Yes. Yeah, and it's just... the ta Its attacks aren't that great, so... Mm. Oh, come on, I want to... Thank you, zoom in. Um, I mean, okay, what? Why would you do that? So it's, what, 20 for the first attack, and what is it? For the second, because it's... Okay. Oh. Did you hear that? <laughs> that was a cat's automatic feeder. I didn't hear that, no. Good. Uh, well that... I, is... It'll probably come through on the, the video, though. Um, yeah. Because your mic seems to pick up a lot more on that than Discord does. Um... I mean, it's not great. It's not. <laughs> it really isn't. I don't know why I didn't attach to the Pikachu, but okay. Because then he could have just, like, surely... You attach to the Pikachu, you then X speed, and... Then just stop I mean, that, that's the thing, if there's, if there's an X speed in hand, that's absolutely the play. If there isn't... I don't know, you're kind of going for a slightly longer game. If that makes sense? Yeah. I think this is another loss. <laughs> yes. Yes, it is. Okay. There's, there's cards coming. Uh... Okay, that's Mewtwo. Uh... I mean, you want to evolve Curlier, yeah. Yeah. Just thinking, like, I, can't, I can't really let this die. Yeah. And attached to Mewtwo but for damage thing is, is not worth it. He does 30 to any Pokemon, so he could, if he wanted yes. to, just kill the Curlier. I mean, not with 30 damage, but... Well, you could just start racking up damage on it, but... Yeah. I mean, you wouldn't just specifically target the Curly, I suppose. Would you? No. I, I think it wants to hurt your Mewtwo far more because it's already taken a point. Yeah. Okay, so X-Speed and switch into Mewtwo? Uh, yeah... Oh. I don't know. Okay, well you're taking too long, so I'm gonna yeah. make the decision for, decision yeah, you, for you. I'm, I'm basically thought, sort of stuck into the fact that it will just retreat into Pikachu and swing. It's yeah, it's not ideal. I mean, um, and that just sets up the two-hit KO. Because even right now it's gonna do what sixty. Stop Which it. you'd have to put. Bloody have cats. to buy both potions on it. Come here. Wait, did you not attach to Mewtwo? No, I attached to the Curlier and swang. Why? Because I had five seconds to do something. I specifically told you that no matter what you were doing, you were attaching to Mewtwo. I didn't hear you, sorry. <laughs> Felix! Stop it! Because there was no point in the damage from the Curlier, it was just whether or not you wanted to retreat the Curlier. Well, it's too late now. We're gonna lose anyway. This game was... It was an uphill battle to begin with. Dealing with you is an uphill battle. <laughs> I can't believe I'm getting bullied on my own stream. What the hell? It's so much so that you even closed it. <laughs> Why is it? This is the bloody paw. It just decides to pop out. Occasionally. 
Uh, it's annoying. That's why I can't use my fast charge for some reason because it just doesn't work. It just pops out. Okay. Cat, can you stop doing that? I think the cat is within its rights. Cat just does what it wants. Now, weirdly enough, um, if you top deck a god of white, you win. I. To be, wait, what? Not me, right? That's not me. His, his time. Yeah, yeah um, I don't know why he didn't bring far. in the Pikachu earlier, to be honest. Um, strange. But I only have but the one card. Obviously, it can't, so... it can't finish you, but if you draw into Gardevoir, you can evolve, you get the two energy attachments, and you just KO. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> the other option is... Retreating into... What are you, what are you doing, my guy? What are you doing? I don't know. I... Gambling? No, not even gambling. It's, uh... Oh, we got it! Talk about top decking! I can't believe it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> See? You, this is what happens when you actually listen to me. I said, you know, if you just top deck a Gardevoir, you'll win, and then you top deck the Gardevoir. This, this is how it works. That's what happens when I listen to you. 